Hello, mofos. I've missed ya. Today, I'm going to the dentist. Welcome back to my channel. I don't like the dentist. I don't like anything to do with um, any kind of anything like that, to be quite to be quite honest with you. Oh, fun fact. These two teeth, are you good? Are you good? They're fake. They're fake. So what happened? I was like eight years old, walking down my, my grandma's steps at her house. Walking down, everything's fine. And then all of a sudden, I trip and fall and I smacked my gums. So I had my, I didn't have my adult teeth in yet, but what they did is they killed the adult teeth before they came in. Had cracks in it and it was yellow. Um, yeah, so about two years ago, I got a veneer in, but they were like, we can't just do one because then the other one could be off center. So these are both veneers, permanent veneers, and they're gonna be there forever. So that's the tea, sis, that's the tea. Cute little fit today, cute little fit if you wanna see. These little track pants with a little tie, this cute little sweater. Shout out to Giselle, freaking babe. She gave it to Julia, Julia gave it to me. My camera's kind of being an asshole right now, so we're just gonna see what happens. So one thing I've been doing a lot lately, I know I do this in some of my videos, but my makeup, I like doing it in kind of like this pink, like a pink vibe. So the lips are, it's Mary Kay, my grandma works there, so she gave me the lipstick. And then my eyes, I actually use a highlighter. And with the highlighter, I just put it on my eyes, use actual highlighter for my cheeks, and a little for the nose. And also, as I've showed you in one of my past videos, my eyebrows are like assholes. So basically, I just touched, I just like, Fill them in a little bit right there. Anyways, we gotta go, cause I'm gonna be late. We're gonna go, we're gonna go on the drive. It's about an hour drive. Let's, let's get on the road, let's get it going. Oh, I actually have so many cool things to tell you. I'm going to Whistler for my birthday with one of my best friends and we're going in three weeks. So that's gonna be super sick. So there's gonna be a really cool vlog coming from that. Scott here, I'm not looking forward to this. I don't like this. Anyways, so here going in, Gonna get that cleaning, gonna see if I have any cavities. And then we're gonna go. And then we're gonna drive back. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Ah! No, no, no. Yes, it's a new day. I got my teeth done and then I stopped filming. So. Mm. Today, I'm gonna take you back to one of my cottages and we're gonna chill by the lake and you're gonna meet my animals. And it's gonna be so much fun, I can't even tell you. Look at the water. <laughs> Why am I a fucking frog? <laughs> okay, let's go. Anyways, I got my shit. I got a little Ariana Grande thingamabob on the top of my head. And uh, let's go for a drive. Check out this cute little fit though, right? This is cute, this is cute shit. My mirror is also super dirty, but we're not gonna we're not gonna focus on that. One fun fact about me that I bet most of you don't know is I am obsessed with my bed being perfect. So I can't go like I'm leaving and I just came in to check my bed to make sure there was no wrinkles or kinks in anything because I just need it to be perfect when I come back to my room. This is my child. This is my baby. So when I'm leaving my room and it looks all clean and perfect, I'm like, oh my god, I'm trying. Look at all my freckles. I'm trying to set this up right now with my wallet to hold my phone up. <gasps> no, stay. So sick of this attitude. Jesus Christ. Okay, that's my mark. Oh, who is a professional? Step one, get in the car. Step two, we're gonna put our seat belts on. You know why? Cause we're not trying to die. We're trying to live. Step three, you're gonna turn on your vehicle, folks. You're gonna turn it on. Yep. Step four, you're gonna get off your phone and focus on driving, see you at home. Actually, I'll probably show you like a tour on the way to the house, cause it's a really nice drive. Anyways, that's it. So close, I can almost taste it. I can almost taste it. Apparently people say I have a phone voice. So you're gonna hear it now. Bonjour, Bonjour, comment ça va? Ça va bien, vous? Très bien. Is it possible to do the, um, a strawberry refresher? I'll do the venti size. For sure, did you want lemon No, thank you, just all water. So, venti, anything else for you? Um, 
No, that's everything. Perfect. She'll be five, six, nine, so the window. Thank you so much. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay, so I just got to Shovel. This is the town. It's like 15 minutes from my town. And I'm stopping at this little place I used to work at. And I'm getting a veggie and hummus wrap. Freaking amazing. And she makes homemade pesto. So shout out to Cafe 349 and Shovel. Literally the best homemade sandwiches, sauces, wraps, salads ever. Um, so yeah, putting the mask on. And we're going in. This this does work well actually though with my outfit because I've got like the got the black skirt. So the black skirt with this, I kind of look like a badass. I'm also parking right now in a no parking zone. And I'm literally in front of a fire hydrant. And in the city, you'd get a huge fine for this, but it's the country and nobody gives a fuck. You can literally park wherever, even if it says you can't, and nothing will ever happen to you. So I got the food. It's gonna be amazing. But then I thought to myself, it's a sunny ass day. And anytime it's a sunny day, all Julia wants to do, my best friend, is tan. So I was thinking I'm gonna come to her house and I'm gonna scare her because she's probably on the back deck, like 90% she's on the back deck tanning. So we're gonna go scare her. So I stopped here and she was inside putting sunscreen on, which honestly ruined my plans. I'm not very happy about it. I'm happy that she's putting sunscreen on, like that's good. But I like, know, you got through to me. Sunscreen is what you gotta do when it's hot out. <laughs> Hello, Riley from the future. Uh, so basically, I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an like input before I go to the next video and you're like, what is this happening? So we've had some of our cats and animals go missing in the past because we do live in the country. So we're not guaranteed that we're going to get our animals back if we let them out for the night because they could be taken by a fisher, they could get hit on the road. There's many options. So we made a cat enclosure and essentially they can go out of the house through a tunnel, go into the cat enclosure, and then they can go back into the house whenever they want. Huh? Baby. Hi, baby. Hi, Gideon. Hi, oh, baby. What a baby. baby also a little bit of input here so you're about to see my dog kaya she's three years old she's a purebred german shepherd she has a limp because she tore her ligament so we need to get her surgery and we're getting surgery for her in about two weeks but until then she has a bit of a limp and we have to watch what she does so she doesn't strain herself <gasps> give me a babies <clears throat> how is your little chicken doing little chicken eh So beautiful you're so naturally pretty can you take a sip of the drink please that's right look at that jawline this is no joke my sister is a beautiful baby boy a beautiful baby boy yay i don't like to be fondled beautiful baby boy i don't like to be fondled like you fondle your ball sacks <laughs> Hey, this is the cottage and we're just chilling right now we're just chilling up here might go for a boat ride later it's a beautiful freaking day Big boy. Hello. 